Okay, how are we doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth. I'm the creator of Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Oops, sorry about that. Nano Technology Gain. All right, so you got a lot of people out there who have black projection screens or screen paints or whatever it may be. But my biggest question is what is the difference between your black screen paint and our panel or whatever you may have than anybody else? What, okay, let's put it this way. It's shortening. What is the difference between your black technology and everybody else's now? As I said before, you know, we do demonstrations that separate us from the rest. We have some people out there claiming that they have the same thing we have. Well, they don't do our same demonstrations. So we'll make this a bit of a two-day challenge for anyone who wants to take on this challenge. What is the difference between your black technology versus our black technology? Now, looking at the screen, you probably think you only see one screen. There's actually two screens in there. Let me come over here real quick. Let's get real close up on the screen. You see it now? There you go. This right here is a luminous. This is a luminous panel right here. All right. I'm gonna put that right there against this black screen and show you that all black screens are the same. Let's remove this. First of all, we're gonna do a snow scene. All right. Now, snow scene is very important. Anybody can do contrast. Well, let's do a snow scene. And let's show you that there's a difference between our screen and a black screen. Now you keep in mind, as you can see the luminous is producing a higher white level. That's one of the things we brag about, brag and boast, so we do, come on, and it's, the technology is good. It can produce a higher and brighter white level than most screens. Now, like I said, it's a two day challenge. I challenge anyone out there, screen paint, whatever you may have, if you can do the same thing we're doing here. Two black screens, white snow scene, and you have to be able to produce a white level higher than the black screen you have behind you or you're matching it against. There you are, right there on camera. There's no gimmicks, nothing at all. Fully lit environment. My projector's sitting back around probably, you know, we're, we're 13 feet here, so around 12 feet here, all right? So I'm about a foot away from, from the my previous, where I put my projector at, my previous setting, where I, well actually where I set my projector at, full 1080p DLP projector, view sonic, 3200 lumens. We've got two screens that are black right there, okay? Move that away, and you can see where our technology is producing a higher white level than a black screen. Like I said, I've done this demonstration matching white levels on a DMP Supernova, uh, their blade, the most highest, uh, most lightest screen I've seen so far, and a very good screen, a Seymour 81.3. I haven't seen anybody do that demonstration yet. Now it's funny how some people will try to compare our technology to a certain company under SI. Uh, let me explain something to you. Um, there's a difference in the technology. Just trust me when I tell you that. Also, too, to tell you the truth is also there's a huge difference in price also. So, yeah, uh, that pretty much was a fail attempt on whatever that was trying to be. But, nice try. But anyway, um, let's move on from there. So, this is going to be a bit of a two-day challenge for anyone who has from a black technology. What is the difference between your technology and another black screen? Like I said, it's easy to do it if you're doing on a contrast against contrast. We're doing white levels here. Very hard to do. Now, keep in mind, you know, with this new technology, you know, you don't have to worry about if you got a black screen, the level's going to be too dark, it's not going to be bright enough for your projector. As you can see right here, the white levels are much higher on the luminous than it is on the nano black. That is a nano black screen, by the way. Keep in mind, it's a nano black. All right, so let's come over here first. Let's come over here and let's drop our lights. Go lights up for a minute. Nice and dark in here. All right, and we'll go up and you'll see, look at this. Lights on. See, it's me tripping over the back of my chair right here. i to pull it back for the demonstration. Now, we're gonna go over here, we're gonna grab another video. Camera focus a little better there. 
You know, I have people email me and say, what is the difference between the luminous and the nano? Well, this is the difference. The luminous can produce higher white levels. And we're gonna make this a two-day challenge. Now keep in mind, the screen is producing contrast levels and white levels at the same time. And when we say that this is the brightest black screen on the market, it is. See how that contrast blends in? Now let's go over here and let's grab this. Okay, I'm Kenneth from Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain or Nanotechnology Gain. Gotta get used to saying that. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I can thank you all for watching. Uh, this is our two-day challenge on the brightest projection screen. I <laughs> know I said that a little too loud, but man, this technology is freaking beautiful. Look at this, man. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And that's one thing I love about this technology. It has, beautiful, it has the ability to, to produce better contrast, of course, because it's black, but the white levels on the screen are freaking amazing. Look at that. All right. Again, hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Thank you all for watching. The panels are available now on our website. I'd like to thank you all. Actually, they're not available now on our website. Sorry, they'll be available probably... Uh, uh, this coming um, this coming week, but we do have in mind we do have the luminous in 100 inch to 120 inch to 143 inch and blackout cloth, and we do have them in other panels like that thin wallpaper panel that is actually two by four. Let me go put my panel real quick. There you go. All right. Thank you all for your time.